So without further ado, please welcome Michelle Wolf. Just a reminder to everyone, I'm here to make jokes. I have no agenda. I'm not trying to get anything accomplished. So everyone that's here from Congress, you should feel right at home. <laughs> I'm gonna try to make fun of the president in a new way, in a way that I think will really get him. Mr. President, I don't think you're very rich. <laughs> like, I think you might be rich in Idaho, but in New York, you're doing fine. <laughs> I did have a lot of jokes. I had a lot of jokes about cabinet members, but I had to scrap all of those because everyone has been fired. <laughs> You guys are going through cabinet members quicker than Starbucks throws out black people. It's kind of crazy that the Trump campaign was in contact with Russia when the Hillary campaign wasn't even in contact with Michigan. <laughs> it's a direct flight. It's so close. Of course, Trump isn't here, if you haven't noticed. He's not here. And I know, I know I would drag him here myself, but it turns out the President of the United States is the one you're not allowed to grab. <laughs> he said it first. Yeah, he did. You remember? Good. I actually really like Sarah. I think she's very resourceful. Like, she burns facts, and then she uses that ash to create a perfect smoky eye. Like, maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's lies. It's probably lies. It's a night about free speech. So uh, by tradition, we do not vet their monologue. We don't censor uh, it. No. I think that she brought to the night what she thought was important to say and that her goal may not have been press unity and everyone rallying around the room to support journalism.